of the Tanner Sauls Pace, the 2003 version honoring the memory of the late great standard bread owner Leon Matches. A field of seven. They are lined up and approaching the start. And they're off, and several are leaving out of there. Articulator flies away from the rail. All-American Campdoor is under early, urging an All-American Theory. Wheels up quickly for Dave Miller. He's three wide on the opening turn. Back off is dropped in in fourth, and racing in fifth on the outside has escaped the wind as they head toward the opening quarter. Armbro Animate is sixth, and last call, Crombie the trailer. All-American Campdoor to the lead, but All-American Theory is rolling up to his outside, and he pokes ahead in front, and escaped the wind is following him. Front quarter in 27 and 1 as All American Theory now takes the lead, hitting the backstretch. Escape the wind up on the outside. He's second and pressing on for Roger Mayotte. All American Capdoor is behind the top pair in third. Articulator, who has hustled away, is fourth on the inside. Back off, racing in fifth as Escape the Wind clears the lead. Armbro Anime gets a tap with the whip, and they're rolling as they head toward the half, trailing his last call, Crombie, and Escape the Wind reaches the half mile marker in 54 and 2. All American Theory second and back off is coming first over for Andy Miller quickly on the outside so no breathers for Escape the Win as back off takes it to him with three eights to go Armbro Animate right there well spotted second over All-American Theory is locked in right now on the inside from fourth All-American Captor racing in fifth and last call Crombie and Articulator shuffled out last where he trails the field and back off is right alongside Escape the Win three quarters and 122 and four All-American Theory locked in he needs to shake free from there as they come to the top of the stretch. Escape the win, fighting on bravely with the lead. All-American Theory waiting for room from the pocket. Armbro Animate is there. All-American Captor. Escape the win, drifting a bit. All-American Theory trying to rally up the rail. All-American Captor closing late on the outside. But it's Escape the win to win again. 151-1. and one. All-American Captor second. Articulator was third. He's a three-year-old gelding by Artescape out of Chicol by Cam Fella. The owners of the Venture 2000 stable and the Early Bird stable of Mississauga, Ontario, Roger Mayotte trains and drives. Escape the Wind was bred in Maryland by the Windback Farms, now 8 for 11 in his racing career. Escape the Wind, a son of Artescape, who ranks second in the nation. Among the sire three-year-old pacers, headed only by his father, Art's Place. Art Escape, of course, a Peretti Farms of New Jersey stallion, managed by Brittany Farms right here in Versailles. And Escape the Wind takes the first division of the Leon Matches Memorial. In the winner's circle is Mrs. Lorraine Matches, the widow of Leon, along with their son, Gary, who's a prominent trainer on the East Coast, and Gary's son, Nick, also joining us tonight here at the Red Mile. Leon Manches, not only a prominent owner, but one of the most popular owners in the sport of harness racing. The CEO and chairman of Avnet Incorporated, which was one of the largest distributors of electronic components, and Leon guided that company into a global enterprise. And he certainly missed, but his memory will remain with us. The Leon Manches Memorial, first division of the Tanner Sauls to escape the wind. <laughs> 